Hey you guys, my name is Vanessa and I'm about to get on this flight to go to Milwaukee. Me and Jelly's on our way to Milwaukee right now. We're currently in the Houston airport and we just got done eating sandwiches. You guys wanna say hi to Jelly? So yeah, we're going to Milwaukee. I'm going to Milwaukee because my grandma passed away and her funeral is tomorrow. And with the Hmong culture, funerals usually last about three to four days, but for my grandma's funeral, it's gonna be Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. And then on Tuesday, I fly back to back home. I'm excited to see my mom and them. It's currently 6.56 p.m. Um, my flight boards at 7.11. 7.11. .11. 7 and then, we don't land to Milwaukee till like 1 a.m. because I got a lay over now. <laughs> I just had a sandwich at the airport and it was okay. But yeah, we're waiting for our flights and I guess I'll talk to you guys a little later. When I get to Atlanta, because we're we're having a layover in Atlanta. Hopefully we make our next flight because the layover is only an hour and you guys know how big Atlanta's airport is. <laughs> Ew, don't record me. Bella was trying to be sexy on FaceTime. She was like this. Mm, mm. Let me um go get this view. Yes, yeah, it's three o'clock in the morning and we're just not landing in Milwaukee. Oh, we're the only flight here. I know. The airport is closed, boo. So yeah, we just landed in Milwaukee. It's it's literally 2.56 a.m. We got to be up by 8. I'm never doing a no, we're not. flight again. We got to be up by 7. 7 a.m. We got to be at the fair home at 8. You guys, we're literally like the only people here. I don't want to argue with nobody in the morning. I know we're going to be arguing. I know we're going to be arguing. I'm getting me a hotel tomorrow because hotel. I haven't stayed with my mom and my sisters in a house with all of us for real, for real since I was like 18. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna get a hotel tomorrow because mm -mm. I ain't gonna deal with it. No, ma'am. I still have to go get my luggage. I'm surprised this airport is still open. It's literally three o'clock in the morning, you guys. Yeah, and my ass hurts. Happy Saturday. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nessa. if you're new here. What's up, what's cracking, what's happening, what's popping, period. I'm on my way to work. It is currently 10 o'clock in the morning. And I'm putting these little air freshener things in my car. I really like these little Febreze air freshener things. I get them on Amazon because they're way, I don't know if it's just me, but I think they're cheaper on Amazon. I'm on my way to work. I have two clients today, but I have like a large gap so I have a client at 10 30 and then I have another client I think at 2 go to the gym because your girl's been working out so yeah that's what my plans are for today and you guys are coming with me today it's gonna be like kind of like a daily vlog it's so hot here you guys like I just don't understand how people can like do car washes and like work outside it's so hot the grass is is brown it's not even green that's how hot it is here um a week ago i went back to milwaukee um because it was my grandma's funeral uh if you follow my instagram you would have known but yes my grandma has passed and then I'm actually going to Milwaukee again the end of this week or the end of this month for my grandpa's funeral because he passed right after my grandma passed. So uh, August has been a little wonky. That's what I have to do this month. It's a lot of traveling back to Milwaukee. So, yeah. Um, I'll kind of talk to you guys a little later once I get to work and then into the gym. So, yeah. Can I get a double shot of a, I mean, a triple shot of espresso and a grande cup? Ice. 
Of course. And then can I get two pumps of white mocha and uh, vanilla sweet cold foam on top? Can I get a ham and Swiss croissant? Ham and Swiss, okay. And then that should be all. All right, we'll see you at the window. Thank you. Thank you. 1077, how are you? Right, good, how are you? Thank you. Do you need a straw? Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you as well. Okay, so I just got to work. Sitting in my car because my client's talking about she's gonna be 10 minutes late and her appointment's at 10.30. So let me show you guys what I got. So I got a triple espresso and a grande cup ice with vanilla sweet cold foam and two pumps of white mocha. Delicious. This remind me, this drink remind me of um, Vietnamese coffee. It's strong like Vietnamese coffee, but it still has like a slight like sweetness to it. Cause I like my coffee to still taste like coffee with a little bit of hint of sweetness. And then I got a ham and Swiss croissant because I'm going to the gym after and I need to eat something before I go to the gym or else I'm gonna pass out. And then um, I have sriracha packets from Starbucks. You guys, the sriracha at Starbucks is actually fire. If you guys ever, um, if you guys like your breakfast a little spicy, this one is so good. Shouldn't even be ripping it with my teeth, but I don't know where my scissors are. So I'm about to eat this, and then we're gonna go into my suite in a little bit. Gym skis and yeah, good workouts. Hello, motherfuckers. I just got done working out and I think I'm about to get a blister back in my foot. It's hot, I'm so hot. And yeah, I'm about to go to the cribs because I gotta get in the shower. And then I have another client at three. I'm gonna make me something to eat, something quick or whatever. And that's basically the plans of what I'm about to do, period. My workout was good. So I just started working out like maybe about two and a half weeks ago. And I just had to slowly get myself into working out. So for me, I just been walking on the treadmill. And I walk on the treadmill for about 30 to 40 minutes. Today I did 35 minutes. And I had to like slowly get myself into it because if I go hard the first couple days of working out, I'm just, I can't go back the next day. Like, I feel like for me, I have to slowly work and pace myself. I know some people like to just go straight in and go hard. Me? No. I need to slowly work myself into working out because working out is so, it feels good, but it's just like, I don't want to be sore as f the next day like i want to be able to still go back the next day and have a good workout and like i said i really just walk i don't lift weights yet i'm gonna start lifting weights probably in the next two weeks so yeah that's what i'm doing hey guys it's a few hours later i end up cooking and having to do my client's makeup but i just made cabbage because we're all trying to be skinty so I do want to show you guys what I got from Amazon. Cause I was supposed to go see the Barbie movie today, yesterday. See, I was supposed to go see the Barbie movie. Sorry, that's bad. He doesn't know how to chill. He don't have no chill. See, I was supposed to see the Barbie movie the other day, and I bought stuff for the Barbie movie, but I ended up not going to see it. So the first thing I got was these earrings from Amazon. These are so cute. I gotta show you guys. I got a silver pair too before. They're upstairs somewhere in my makeup room. I got these earrings. They're like pink. So cute. They're pink and gold. I got a new outfit. But these are the earrings. They're so pretty. 
and sparkly. Um, I will have all the Amazon links to this and then the other item for you guys down below. The next thing I got was I got this pink corset top. This is so freaking cute. Look how stinking cute this is. You guys know corset is coming back in style. If you don't know, you know now. Um, corset tops are coming back in style. This corset top is actually really good quality. I got a size medium because I have smaller tatas, but it does have like the hooks in the back, which I love. And this corset top reminds me of the corset tops from Urban Outfitters because Urban Outfitters sell these corset tops that's literally the exact same. They just come in different colors. And on Amazon, I believe they do have different colors where it's like the lace is one color and then the mesh is another color. And I got this for, let me show you guys right now. Because I know the ones from Urban Outfitters are about, I want to say like $50 to $60. This corset top from Amazon was only, I think it was like $25. <laughs> it was $21. $21 and it literally came within one day to have Amazon Prime. Which if you don't have Amazon Prime, what are you doing? But I'm going to order some more of these. These are actually like really good quality. Um, I think if you have bigger breasts, it might not work out in your favor but if you you know like a lot of cleavage i'm all for it if you like it i love it yeah this is so cute so what i was gonna do is i was gonna wear this wear a pair of jeans and i got like these hot pink shoes that literally is this color like this pink color is like fuchsia color that i got from fashion nova but yeah that's what i wanted to wear but i guess i'm just gonna have to wear it for a different outfit for a different event but oh my gosh i'm about to order a white one like this because girl what this material is actually fire. I just cannot believe how good quality this corset is. For only $20, you guys better go get it before they sell out. Because the girlies on TikTok is raving about Amazon clothing. And I found this on my own, but I know the girlies on TikTok is probably talking about it. But very, very good quality. I like this corset top a lot. I'm chilling for right now. Kevin might, I might go with Kevin later to go get some tacos. My face is really oily because I put some aqua for my face. So, yeah, period. We're now like a wet naked mole rats. So I'm gonna put this stuff up. I'll talk to you guys a little later. Um, I really don't have no other plans for tonight. Tomorrow I have to work. I have to go early, go to the gym. And then I need to get a wax. And I need to build my... I bought some new stuff for my suite that I need to build. Like I need to build, I have like a drawer set that I have to build and I got a new desk because I had the desk that I have right now for a year now and she needs to get upgraded. She needs to get upgraded. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys a little later. 6 a.m. I am on my way to work. It's too early. I feel a little delirious right now, but... I'm here at Starbucksies because I need to get my coffee fix before I go to work. I have to drive an hour away to this location for this company that I work for. And I'm exhausted. I didn't go to bed till like 1 o'clock in the morning yesterday. Oh my god. Let me make a TikTok. It's an hour away from me. Which is cool, I guess. Because everything's far here in Houston. I have to do... It's basically a photo shoot for clothing company that i work for not work for but work with and i'm so tired you guys my back hurts i haven't been getting good sleep lately and i don't know why what the fuck do these people order no, i'm tired oh my god i need to wake up i'm about to drive for an hour or so yeah i'll see you guys once i get there Cause you, you my bitch, bitch who keep fucking around every time. Bitch, you the fuck. So there was a car accident on a freeway. I hope these people is okay. Get over, sir, so I can go through. Damn.
and somebody's car is under the fucking <gasps> semi truck. What the fuck? Oh my god. Let me not do too much because we just gotta get to my destination. But did you just see that? Somebody's car was under the fucking semi truck. Hope they're okay. Dear God, please let those people that just got into a car accident be safe and please be with them because that's, that's crazy. That just made my heart drop, you guys. Like, ugh, just made me feel like just like nauseous. I don't know. Um, if you don't know, I got into a really bad car accident in 2021, and just seeing that just kind of gave me like flashbacks a little bit and it just uh, oh my gosh that's so scary so yeah um i just texted the uh, girls that i work with that i'm running late because there was a car accident on the freeway so yeah i'll talk to you since i get there because <laughs>